Chris, nagpasalamat sa mga nagdarasal at nag-update sa pinagdadaan ng sakit. Sa kanyang social media account, muli nagbigay ng update tungkol sa kanyang pinagdadaan ng karamdaman ang Queen of All Media, Miss Chris Aquino. Matamang ipinaliwanag ni Chris ang gamot ang pinagdaraanan at ang mga gamot na ibinibigay sa kanya para malampasan ang pagsubok na ito. Ibinita din ni Chris ang walang hanggang pananalig na siya ay gagaling sa tulong ng mga pamilya Kaibigan at mga tagahangang patuloy na nagdarasal para sa kanya na lubos na ang pinasasalamatan. Sa mga larawan na ibinahagi ni Chris, makikita ang kasama niya sa ospital na pinagpapagamutan ang putihing Vice Governor ng Batangas, Mark Leviste. I chose the midpoint between my mom's 14th death anniversary and my dad's upcoming 40th death anniversary to thank all of you who continue to pray for my recovery. My dad immediately died after being shot while descending the stairs to the tarmac of what was then Manila International Airport, 21 August 1983. My mom died of stage 4 colon cancer on 1 August 2009. Upon initial diagnosis, our mom was given 3 months. But she fought hard, knowing her five kids weren't ready. Our mom underwent all the most painful treatments, and God granted us 17 more months. It's been 17 months since my charge straws, EGPA diagnosis. Dr. Malika Gupta gave me my second dose of a biological injectable, unfortunately not available in the Philippines to help lower my very high LGE. She calls me a badass because kinakaya ko even though malapot at mahapdi yung ini-inject at malalim, kailangan ibaon yung pre-filled high-tech syringe. Yes, matapang na ko sa halos lahat ng kailangan pagdaanan at mataas ang pain tolerance ko. It's the aftermath, 72 hours feeling Kagaya ng bigat after a COVID vaccine, but times 3. Yes, parang 3 times akong na Pfizer or Moderna. This will be every other week, optimistically, for me to reach remission over the next 10 to 12 months. Every other Tuesday is both my biological injectable plus methotrexate my chemotherapy medication taken one times a week being used as an immunosuppressant to help me reach remission for three of my autoimmune conditions. Thank you because our prayers are being answered. My last blood panel showed improvement. It's slow progress. I have a long way to go. It's likely that after a few months, another medication will be introduced to my body by UCLA's Dr. Balperio. But I am against all odds because of all my limitations with medicinal options. Finally, on the correct path to remission and a better quality of life. Thank you to all. Thank you, God. Hashtag faith. Clarification, autoimmune disorders have no cure, but life-threatening damage on the patient's organs can be prevented or managed if diagnosed early and or given the proper treatment. Taos pusong nagpasalamat si Chris sa kanyang mga anak, sa kanyang mga kapatid, sa mga pinsan at matatalik na kaibigan. Gayun din, nagpaabot ng pasasalamat kay Vice Governor Mark at sa mga anak nito. Lubos din ang kanyang pasasalamat sa mga taong tumutulong sa kanya sa Amerika at dito sa Pilipinas at sa lahat na nagdarasal at nagpapadala ng mensahe sa kanya. Thank you for inspiring me to not give up 
and to have the fortitude to keep on going, regardless how hard this journey has been. Bim and Kuya, my sisters, Ate, Pinky, and Biel. Grateful for Dr. Katsi, my cousins, plus one, in our chat group, Anne Binay and Michael Leiba. Mark, my other 16-year-old giant, C2, RL, and Gabby, and ASL. Our team, Ate Rome and Kuya Art, Kuya Noel, Joss and Daniel, Anthony, Diano, Ate Lovely and Pretty, and Alvin. Our adoptive Aussie family, Ate Vina, Ate Mercy, Dr. Henry, Minnie, and Kuya Allen, and Ate Irene. Our other kind friends, Tita Mary Ann and Kimora, Ate Lorna, Attorney Pia and Diana, and Ate Ray. In the Philippines, Rochelle, Czech, Jane, Jeff, Joseph, and Mike. All the religious from all faiths who have constantly prayed for my family and me. To all who take time to message just to stay in touch. Samantala, marami ang kinilig sa iniwang comment ni Vice Governor Mark sa post na ito ni Chris na nagpahayag ng wagas na pagmamahal at pagsuporta. Kids and I will always be by your side. For better or worse, for richer or poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish forever. Please subscribe and hit the notification bell para ma-update kayo sa sunod na showbiz news.